Bernard looking to bring it in bounds. He's carefully being watched by Thibault. Jackson, Thibault running at him a three. Jackson hard to the rim and a good finish by Triple J. Again, Walker has that length. Sometimes you can't finesse it off the gym. Colin Sexton misfired from three. Temple's trying to push Tempo. Kennard, boy, finally got one to drop. It's been a struggle. It's a little bit better than the first. Things like this are tough, especially at this point when the lead's pretty much insurmountable. Vince Williams Jr. gives way. And Shaq Harrison with the layup to make it 119-97. Vince Williams on a rebound, four on three if they hurry. Zaire, a rhythm three. Bango. Jaron going downhill. Pretty spin and a finish. Put Walker Kessler in the spin cycle. Williams has it back. Deep in the shot clock now for Noel. Those are disciplined closes and switches by the man. But nonetheless, good defense for 23 seconds, but Aldama still hits a shot at the end of the possession. You know, you're going to do it by committee, replacing that Luka production. You need guys to step up. Seth Curry's been a big factor coming off that bench. Jalen Noel chased off the three-point line and takes a smooth-looking mid-range jump shot. On the bounce, Jalen Noel. Noel couldn't get past Grant Williams. Now he floats out to the three-point line and hits. He is having himself a game. Yeah, that's, and that's only done because there's a rule in place to do it. Yeah. Williams back on the floor here. Jackson Jr. Having a really good game. Grant trying to one-hand that pass. It gets stolen away by the Grizzlies. Aldama puts it on the deck. Sanji Aldama. He don't want to get the shot. Contra knocks it down. Oh, wow. Big collision. Powell and Exum both go down. Grizzlies playing five on three. A Bain three is through. Timeout Dallas. Our guy Fitty. Fitty. Good job. <laughs> The Ambo with the hook in the paint there. Vince Williams doing exactly what he has done. So he's been giving consistent minutes with this Grizzlies team. And Jaron doing what he has been doing the last couple of games, which is attacking the rack against Green. The Ambo flashes topside. Six to shoot. Vince Williams working against Dylan Brooks. Finds Biombo. Who gets the roll? After three quarters, after trailing by 19. Jaron against Landale. Late double by Green. Yes, and the foul. It's very well in transition. It seems like almost once a post game, he says he just takes what the defense is giving him. And it's one of the common. When John Moran's first off-court incident happened. There is good news for the Grizzlies. They're hopeful to get Marcus Smart and Luke Kennard back maybe as early. Brandon Ingram, though, because understanding who you're playing. Jaron Jackson off ball is coming to block, and Ingram understood that and able to find Zion. But how about Jaron Jackson Jr.? Foul trouble here early, but running two-man action, but effective for New Orleans. Williams shovels one to Biombo. Nice finish, Bismack Biombo. Defensive side also with second and third efforts and did not allow the Pacers to get out and run and finish. Aldama for three. Bango! 21 consecutive games with a three-point make for Santi Aldama. And we are styling with our jaw ones tonight. <laughs> so is Rob Fisher, by the way. Zaire for three. It's through. Zaire Williams. Heel drives. Five to shoot. Grizzlies collapse. Force a turnover. Three on three. Bain going downhill. Scooping and scoring. Well, guys, I just asked assistant coach Ronald Norwood, how do the Hawks need to close out this fourth quarter to get the dub? And he said, first, it starts with stopping Ja defensively, make it as difficult as possible for them to score without fouling. And then offensively, he said, we need to move the ball and create stuff. Williams off the deflection, gets into the paint, and that sets up the wrong guy. It's a good pass by Vince Williams. Biggest lead of the game for either side. Ja Moran. And a great job. Wow. Man, on his way down, I wow. said he could hang. 
because Dyson was right there. Zion. Speaking of too good. Yep. And wow. Take it away. They doubled him. Marcus Smart back to back. Yes. Two big shots by Marcus Smart. Murray inside. Down he goes. Grizzlies have it. And Conchar all the way for the land. Six games. So he's been in his zone. Contra. Got it. John Contra. Extra pass in the corner to Smart for the tie. It's good. Jackson goes down. Smart knocks down the tray. Second bucket for Coffee. Jackson for three. Oh, it settles in. 13 for Jaron Jackson. Wasn't a guy that was used early in the rotation, but they brought him along. That's the faith that they've had in him. He signed a contract a year ago, and the Clippers have been better for it. Westbrook. Powell open for the three. Roddy filling the lane, lays it up and in, counted at a foul. Yeah, and the indecision wound up producing the worst thing that could happen, which is a turnover. And now you have another three-point shot. And Ty Lue will not like what he sees right now. And you're letting Memphis right back in the game. Vince Williams into the spin. Aldama, yes, against the shot clock. And Alex Len at the same time. I'm not sure they're short-selling him a little bit. Looks even taller. Vince, pump fake, sets up Jaron. Open three. Yes, sir, Jaron Jackson Jr. Here's his third triple of the game. Moran trying to set up the screen. Sends a three. And that one in and out, but Vince Williams, offensive rebound. Out to Kennard, a reload three. Bango! Just under eight points and eight rebounds. Nearly matched that here in the first quarter. Shot attempt and with the left hand is Jackson Jr. Bernard's led the NBA in three-point percentage in two different seasons in his career. He was forced to give the ball up and gave it up to Marcus Smart, who drills a three. Vince Williams, the offensive board. Roddy laying open. Oh wow. Drops the hammer. Hey now. Trying to thread the needle to Williams. Williams lost it. Good hands by Vince Williams. Roddy wants three. Money. The other way. Quickly, Desmond Bain. At this point, to throw him the ball and make him the playmaker. Still a lot of time left. Zyre Williams for three. Has something to say to somebody in the 17 offensive rebounds and a 21 to 8 advantage in second chance points. Vince Williams feed inside Tillman. Second three of the game. Yes, and the foul. Hartenstein can't get the rebound. Kennard can. This is a very good rebounding Nick team. Extra pass, a Gilliard three out of the corner. It's through, and the Grizzlies an 8-2 lead. See the smaller lineup now on the floor with Xavier Tillman out of the game. Rebounding by committee. GG Jackson for three. Rebound. Gilliard flies in for the offensive rebound. Luke, another open look. Bango. Grizzlies have the lead, 45-40. Nice cut. Cutter. Tillman! Yes! Yes! Xavier Tillman Sr. Vince Williams inside position. Great box the rebound. Out of Randall. Vince, love for yes! GG in the reverse slam! Let's see the Knicks continue to try to flex their muscles here in this second half. Roddy against Hartenstein gets that one to go. Hartenstein had denied him twice in the first half. Hartenstein with three blocks. Grizzlies love the potential they see from him. And Anobi, I thought, got away with a walk. Again. Tillman again. Up ahead to Vince. Drop off. X! X go give it to you! Hart banks in a three. It's five points scored here. It should be a two-pointer. Five points here in this fourth quarter that have come with bailout shot. Now it's Kaminga. Williams, the spin and kick. 
Jackson takes the baseline and floats it in. And Gigi Jackson is not shy. Going into halftime, see if that experience is able to prevail. Roddy steps through and great finishes at the rim. That's a great move. Memphis takes the Golden State turnover. And Williams on the push up the floor. Aldama, no hesitation. He connects from deep. And Williams Jr., he really... Still a high flyer when he can get to the rim. And he puts Golden State up by three. Kennard ties it up. Silky smooth delivery. But they have found some good ways to maneuver. And here comes Ooh, Jackson with a good handle and a drive and a two. That's twice the big... People in the organization have told me they believe this group has learned from what they called quote-unquote immature losses a season ago and are more prepared and locked in to take advantage of what is now... Kanjar and Kennard. Well, another thing that Minnesota wants to continue to do is play well at home. Whoa, what a pass. What a pass by Williams. Cutting beautifully was Tillman. Jackson with the ball. Vince Williams on the wing. He's a second-year player out of VCU. Got the screen. Got the switch. Jackson will launch a three. Jaron Jackson. McDaniels takes it in with an offhand, and it's picked up inside by Vince Williams. And he'll come the other way. Kennard, three, kaboom! Well, that's how Memphis started this ball game by a three. I imagine that at times that can clash when you're in a professional setting, when you're in a professional relationship. I imagine it gels a lot of the time. And for you guys, it seemed like it gelled more than it clashed. And, uh, you know, it was a blessing. This is a great place to play basketball. You know, um, just being over here, I still get the chills every time I come into this building. Williams the other way. Kennard drifting free. Gilliard gets a step on Bubba. Here comes the bulldozer. David Roddy with a windmill slam. Jaron Jackson Jr. He's had a rough night offensive. He's had six of his shots blocked tonight. Gigi Jackson can't miss tonight. From the hash mark in on the diagonal, too. Such a good receiver and finisher of the basketball. Jared Jackson scores inside that time over the top of Jimmy Butler. Big rebound there by Vince. Good look ahead here. Oh, look Conchar. ahead. Conchar, he lays it up and in. Miami's defense asleep at the switch, and the Grizzlies go up seven. Beware of footsteps behind you. Aldama for three. Bango. Saki Aldama. Gigi. Baseline jumper. Yes. Gigi Jackson. Jaron drives. Got to the cup and laid it in. Very hard when he's playing one on one. Vince thought about it. Jaron. Floater. Yes. Little half hook from Jaron Jackson Jr. Back in December, 116-103. That was Morant's second game back. This guy is a load, and he goes right to work. It's going to be hard for Jalen Smith to keep him out of the paint. By the way, at the halftime, they took a rebound away from Jaron Allen, so he doesn't have the double-double yet, but I'm sure it's coming. Jaron trailing three, puts it in. Jaron, nice little spin move, got to the cup and laid it in. There's another turnover, and that's one Andre just trying to force a pass that's not there. Don't need it. Vince Williams is bumped. Too many nights I see him trying to search for the magic plays, and those don't always happen for him. Rose tried to turn the corner over Santos, and good. Leads back to 12 for Golden State. Vince Williams into the paint, got up to the corner for Jackson. He'll go to his right. Rolling hook is good. That's tough. That's tough. And Green now has seven points. Gilliard back out to Williams. Cross court. Gilliard looking for his fourth three of the night. He got it. Man. Well, they got a few years. They got a few championships. <laughs> yes, first. Exa exactly. Um, Speaking as uh, the three pointer goes down. Hey, Clyde, come over here. He calls me over. He can beat these guys. Oh, this is that, man. That's the way he is. Then uh, he'll call me tomorrow like, Clyde, really thanks, man. Thanks for all you do. Working with you ages a man terribly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy, oh, boy. A lot of action. No points on the board for the Knicks. Walmart had it. Got it knocked away. Is that hard? 
Hits the three. That's the way to answer after a tech. By the way, that was his first technical of the season. The guy that could come in and put points on the board quickly. Yeah, again, last year, last January, as Kennard backs it home, they were tied for first with the eventual champion Nuggets in the West. Jaron on a back down, has the mismatch, shot clock at six. Jaron steps out for three, it's three. Jaron Jackson Jr. delivers a three. DeRozan drives into the crowd, Vince. lost it. Vince Williams on the pickup. Nice. nice drop off, Gigi back to back dunks. Great way to close the quarter. Speaking of three point shooting, Grizzly's gonna welcome back as a steal by Vince. As Pippen running the wing, flares it out. Pip for three, it's through. Scotty Pippen Jr. To make it a little tougher of a shot. Jared, that trailing three that he loves. Vince Williams Jr., good basketball IQ, saw Jaron trailing, knows that's the shot he likes. Vince driving, a no look, a Jaron three. Bango! Vince Williams Jr., the little look away, and Jaron splashes. Rosen with 19, two for two from downtown. Pippen will try, it's through, and a foul! Vucevic off the back iron. There's Vince with a rebound. Eight, nice. and a look ahead to Aldama for the reverse slam. To make a run of their own. Shot clock down to five. Vince, Gilliard, leaning three, put it in! Was trying to draw contact from Javon Carter. Jackson, yeah, you're right, Del. He can do whatever he wants. That's another shot, but folks, that was a prayer. Trey Jemison, who's coming into the game. Jemison replacing Jackson as the center. That's oh. Gene Gene Jackson, youngest player in the NBA. These are the guys who've been putting up 25 shots a game yeah. just because they had to. You saw it last night. They had to force a lot of shots just to get shots on the rim. Trey Mann also leaves. He's replaced by Michich, who was a real star in our first half. Jackson, he has got a lot of options in the paint. Part guy knows how to move with or without the ball. Williams to Rhodes. 2010. Gee! <laughs> Aldama. Okay. has got to get control of this game. Williams picks up the loose ball. Jackson, 14. This is unbelievable. Look at the numbers. The two newest guys from Oklahoma City who have come over, Luke Kennard and three. Michich and four game offensive slump, averaging fewer than 10. But big against the Trailblazers. Oh, okay. nice. Conchar, the finish. Vince Williams Jr. had eight assists against Charlotte. They needed him to step in in the way that they have. And you talk about Scotty Pippen Jr., the pro-rated situation for him is Kennard knocks down that three. Willie Green's done a good job of getting through to them how to use their hands in passing lanes. Jaron, walk up three, tango. Kennard, corner three, tango. Luke Kennard, four of eight from beyond the arc. Double figures. Mm -hmm. Grizzly's not able to get anything in transition. Yuta off the curl. Little floater. Yuta Watanabe. This group has given Taylor Jenkins what he was looking for. A little bit of bounce, a little bit of juice. Jemison, nice, pretty play. Pelicans one and six when the final margin is three or fewer. Five and ten when it's six or fewer. Nice. Yuta. Nice. Yes, sir. Jaron got to step against Nance, banks it in. A little bit, see what the Pelicans, their struggles are, partner. They become very individualistic in these end of game situations. What do you Jaron? That'd be a Grizzlies playing without a true point guard tonight. Here's Conchar. It's a three, it's through. John Conchar hits from downtown. Steal a game, 1.15, you math nerds. And they like his versatility. Canard for three. Grizzlies three of four from downtown. Tower. You can tell when he's on the floor. 
There is not a drop off from anyone else. Conchar for three again. This is really interesting, Grevin, because. Did not play as Fish reported against New Orleans. Goes on the attack. Euro steps and hits. And here's the difference now. And he's going to straight line drive it. Vince Aldama. Vince Williams Jr., his fifth assist of the game. So Memphis back up by double figures to add the seal off there. Jackson Brooks, there's nothing he can do about it. Dunk by Thompson. Sandy Aldama was there. I'm not sure. I'm not sure he got Look ahead to Conjar who lays it up and in. Two and a half to go in the second quarter. Brooke Lopez has three blocks tonight in the first half. Jackson, pretty ball fake, takes it in with the finish, contorts his body. Goodwin gives it up. Al Donwa working around the perimeter for Williams. Leave it for Zaire Williams and he sticks the three. Easily for the tie, no. Rebounded by Vince Williams. Up ahead, caught by Zaire Williams. He gets behind the defense for the deuce and Doc Rivers. Uh, Williams, ball fake. Beasley trying to stick with him. Eight to shoot. Goodman lines it up. Bullseye, a three. Ooh. 23 points, eight assists for Adena Kumpo. Memphis is nine of 10 in the third. Memphis is 10 of 11 in the third. Trigger in. Williams protecting. Kick. Jackson for the lead. He's got it. Grizzlies team. Working around the perimeter. Ball fake. Williams lost it. Trying to recover. Feeds it to Stevens underneath. Eight points last night, just barely above his season average, and he's got the Clippers in front. Jarrett, little floater, got it to drop in. And having to drop it to the hands of the cutting Terrence Mann, but that's when he's at his best. Those attacks of the basket. Aldama, bango. Sandy Aldama in the league in three-point percentage, so that is a big loss for the Clippers off the bench. Zaire for three, bango. Uh, we were talking earlier tonight on Grizzlies Live, Brevin, about coming back from the All-Star game and, and, and trying to shake off the rust early. Looks like the Grizzlies have done that. In fact, Taylor Jenkins told the team during that last time out. Zaire Williams back on the floor. Good hands by Zaire to knock away. Vince, a look ahead. Gigi goes around. Kawhi goes to the goal and finishes. Very good from multiple positions offensively. Average 118 a game. Jaren. Yes! Westbrook now with 11. Vince, five to shoot. Great find. Up and under in a finish. No more fouls to give. Vince stymied on the sideline. Jared backs down against Kawhi and breaks it in. Grizzlies lead at 93 to 92. Vince Williams Jr. Grizzlies want to run as best they can. Zaire Williams has a driving angle and finishes at the rim. One thing we talked about on our pinnacle effective advice of the game. From downtown against Minnesota on Saturday, they're three of six. Laravia, no hesitation. Three is through for Jake Laravia. D. Rose against Schroeder. D. Rose rises, fires, and fills it. Trying to play with some pace. Vince off the bounce against Schroeder, lost it, got it to Lamar. A Stevens long two is in, Lamar Stevens. When you allow NBA players to get a rhythm early and to continue to, that vibe and play, it's a nice shot there by Luke Lamar. And these are the type of things that can happen. We are underway. Why not run it back, back-to-back -back games? Might as well run the court and the uniforms back-to-back. Jaron -back. Jackson. Penetrating, over the head pass, broken up. Grizzlies started five for six. They missed their last five. Yeah. Second chance points are just piling up. 14 nothing advantage now. And no box out from Ant out of the corner that time with Zion Williams. Wolves have turned it over 11 times. alley -oop to Williams. Grizzlies with a 16-2 advantage in second chance points. 
Goodwin rattles in a tray. You gotta get back. Moore is still on the floor. It's five on four as Aldama. Okay. Gets it back. Three ball. No good. And tapped out of there. Vince Williams has it for the Grizzlies. Stevens with the dunk. Two point game. Simons. Simons against Troy Goodwin. Simons loses his footing and Goodwin with the steal. Grizzlies out looking to run. Zaire Williams ran the floor, never got it, and a three made by Jordan Goodwin. They found a little bit of something in terms of some role play. Jeremy Grant for the miss. Two minutes remaining, and Lamar Stevens going strong to the rack. Aldama in the middle of that zone, swings it outside to Williams. Jump pass to Zaire Williams, tees up a triple and got it. A really good game tonight, and Simon's contribution has been fairly limited. Only seven points. GG, a rainbow three is through. Laravia, a wide open three. Yes! Laravia, three for three from distance, and a timeout taken. Aldama steps out. Four three! Santi Aldama with his. Kind of forced into that shot attempt as wide open as he was. Portland back to man, drop off, and a finish by Lamar Stevens. You don't want to get caught into lackadaisical play because their stars, meaning the, the Grizzly stars, aren't out there. Take care of your business, hit first mentality, and that's a great start with Bridges for three. Uh, speaking of sweet strokes from three. Here's Williams. Off to Aldama. Aldama off one leg, able to bank it in. Stevens spinning in traffic, elevating, and drops it in. I'm looking to see if we see that same energy kind of get back in this game and kind of take control of this situation because right now, <laughs> yeah. they feel good about what they're doing. That They, meaning the Memphis Grizzlies, feel good. Williams, pedal, kicks, Bernard, connects. 453 consecutive regular season games. Doesn't even include all the playoff games. Cunard again. Let's have some work. Grizzlies with the rest advantage. Here's Vince Williams, the second year out of BCU. Luke Cunard led the way Monday up in Brooklyn in that Grizzlies victory. Certainly did not help the Sixer cause. Williams over to Aldama. So the Grizzlies. Aldama not in the picture. Paul took it right back up quickly. Kennard, the lefty, scoop and score. Yeah. Well, like good shooters. Over four minutes to go in our first half. Williams with 10. Kennard for three. Luke Kennard has his second triple tonight. Eight now for Luke. Jackson playing him for the drive, almost daring Paul to shoot that. Paul said, I made a few. <laughs> and Aldama hits the three and draws the foul. I want as many of those. I'll be here till November. Yeah, I was going to say, I want as many of those until we reconvene in November. Jackson Jr. leaning into the three and hitting it. With the rim rocker. How about the timing? Arabia up and in. He did elevate that high. Whether he's coming off the bench or in the starting five, he has continued to deliver for the Sixers. Oh, pass. what a pass. What a pass from Williams. Williams, Aldama, going left, is it up and in, and gets the foul. A miss, tap rebound by Aldama to Conchar, fresh 14 for the Grizzlies, backdoor Conchar, and Vince Williams Jr. Brevin, his court vision and ability to deliver on time and in rhythm is fantastic. Great pass, and a great pass, and Aldama, Trying to build off an outstanding fourth quarter in Philadelphia with the finish. I'm not sure why. Brevin, is that what people in the gym do? Yeah, that's what us gym people do. We like to show <laughs> all of the work that you put in. Hey, hey, as Lamar Stevens makes that three. All the work that you put in, moving those weights. The lack of size. The good, oh, good defense Boom. there by Jamison. Yep. The lack of size they will have. Well, now, Jaron goes out. They bring two bigs into the game. Beautiful setup. Moravia for three. Bingo! Yeah, Grizzlies have been very active with their hands. Bogdanovich lost it. Gabriel on the steal. 
Gabriel played his college basketball, Kentucky, and the Penn Stateer, Lamar Stevens, emphatically. Stevens against Bogdanovich, shot clock, the game clock rather down to 10. Vince curls in the lane, dump off Jemison, another two-handed hammer. Bain still in the ball game for the Grizzlies. Bain drives it, scoops it, and scores it. Aldama thought about a catch and shoot three. Extra pass, a walk up three by Jaron. That's in. Back to back triples for the Grizzlies there within three with 11.6 remaining.